Slater might not even know what he's talking about. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Mitchell Hogue. I play Mac Morris, the son of Zach and Kelly. I pull pranks to kind of get attention, but I don't think it's out of actually trying to get at people. It's kind of trying to cure this luxurious boredom that I get from my dad being governor and having a lot of privilege and white privilege and kind of abusing that. People come in and I get new friends that kind of show me that I can use it for the better. Um, so I am stay the same, but I'm still I'm using it for, for a different reason throughout the series, which is which is fun. My name is Belmont Camelli, and I play Jamie Spano on the show, um, the son of Jesse Spano. Jamie is a very protected kid. Um, his mom is the student feelings counselor at Bayside, and she has instilled in him a lot of those wonderful Jesse Spano qualities that we remember from the original show. Jamie, over the course of the season, is gonna have to confront some uncomfortable truths about his reality, um, since he's kind of been sheltered from a lot, and the new Douglas students um, are gonna be a great way to facilitate growth. Because essentially, Jamie and Mac are just inadvertently reminding Slater of his, his unfortunate loneliness. <laughs> and uh, that moment was, really cool uh, for the three of us to film that scene. Those fights used to happen so often um, between Slater and Zach. And so he could kind of see himself mirrored in us. And, you know, Slater kind of gets on his soapbox trying to explain uh, away our problems. Eventually, Mac and I come to some realizations that, uh, that with, there's really no use in fighting. And uh, Slater might not even know what he's talking about. <laughs> I think there's this inherent struggle within myself of trying to not fill the, fill the shoes of my dad as a person, but fill him as kind of the legacy of the Morris name within Bayside. Um, you know, the pranks and all of that, I think a lot of the times I do them because I want to compete and kind of make my dad proud in some sense. Um, so I don't think I'm, I'm, you know, trying to achieve what he's achieved because I don't want to become mayor at all but, or governor, but I do want to live up to the name and make my parents proud. Jamie and Mac are like pretty much inseparable. They could argue about whatever and, and make up by the end of the day, um, which is a pretty beautiful thing. It goes sour, but I don't think there's ever any crude intentions to it. I think it goes sour because it gives us something to do and it's drama and it amuses us, but I don't think it's ever to the point of like us truly saying like we hate each other um, and like similar to, to you know what Mario and Mark created back then I feel like they egged each other on in a different way where I feel like me and Jamie kind of level each other out in some standpoint of keeping each other on a level of constantly balancing each other of you know if he does this I'll check him on this and I'll do this then he'll bring me back here and then up here and it's it's, it's very leveling and grounding.